But now we're going to take a moment and return to New Jersey and Governor Chris Christie, who's on the phone with us. And Governor, you declared a state of emergency a short time ago, and of course. The memories of Irene have hardly faded with so many people and the power outages and all the troubles there. And now you're looking at another, what's become a rather significant event, Governor. It is, David. It's a very significant event. First thing I want to say to folks out there in New Jersey is stay home tonight. Um, the big problem with this storm, as you've all been reporting, is it's heavy, wet snow that is taking trees down everywhere. And so our problem is that power lines are down. They're very dangerous. Stay away from the downed power lines. Trees are falling. We've got about... 25 full road closures on state roads, about another 60 plus partial closures. So it's going to be very difficult to get around tonight anyway. Over half a million homes have no power at this moment, and that number is going to get larger before it gets smaller uh, because of the heavy, wet snow and leaves still on the trees and those trees coming down and taking down power lines. So if you stay off the roads, it's going to allow the power companies to get out here much quicker and be able to start restoring power. Governor, it seems like northern New Jersey really getting it on the, uh, you know, getting it a little bit on the chin. How about the rest of the state, as you've heard from your folks? You know, we've declared a state of emergency for the entire state, David, but I will say that kind of north of the Mount Holly, Burlington County area, north of there is, is where it's particularly bad, and particularly in the northwest. Sussex, Hunterton, Morris, northwestern Bergen um, are really getting hit very, very hard. Essex County um, has gotten hit fairly hard as well. And so it's really concentrated, most particularly in the northern part of the state. But down in Cape May County, all the way down the southern part of the state, we have flooding because of the storm. Okay. And we have roads closed because of flooding. Well, Governor, your admonition uh, during Hurricane Irene was very effective, as we recall. Uh, just, <laughs> just remind viewers what the state of emergency ultimately allows you and officials to do. Or uh, what it, it, it gives us broad powers under the Disaster Control Act to, to close roads, to change traffic, to um, order people to stay inside. And so it's very broad powers. So... Uh, you know, what I'd say to folks is, listen, tonight, stay inside. If you have power, count your blessings, stay warm. If you don't, get someplace where you can be warm. But stay inside the house tonight uh, and stay off the roads because the roads are a dangerous place to be. But New Jersey DOT is out there clearing, sanding, salting, so that when uh, this snow stops, which should be around midnight in New Jersey, um, that we can then get things going for tomorrow. All right, Governor Chris Christie, thanks for calling in tonight. We'll obviously stay in touch with you and the folks in state government. Thank you, David. Uh, it's been a heavy snow, as we said. It's causing all sorts of problems, really.